Um, and it's locked from the other side. Of course it is. Why make my life easy? Um, come on, come on, work for it, work for it. Yeah, you can do it. You can. There you go. There's a good man. Um, we got what in the world? It looks like someone noted the combination. To Remember, the answer is not present. Which numbers do I need though? Wait. Uh, turn left, turn right. Oh, jeepers. Okay. Um. No, my word. Um. Crap, puzzles. Supposed to make anything out of it. Yeah, that's what, that's what I like to know. Okay, um. Remember, is the answer is not present, which means, let's see here. Uh, seven, eight, nine, four, six, three, two, two, zero, oh, six, nine. Wait, wait, how about this? Uh, there's a four. There's, there's no five. Is there a five in this anywhere? I don't see a single five. All right. We know what? I think. Wait. I'm probably gonna have to write this down. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. All right. Um, the two is five. I, I'm as, I'm assuming this is what it is. What it means. And then we got one. We got ones, two, threes, fours, fives. Any sixes? Uh, nope, six. How about a seven? Are there any sevens? I don't see any sevens. So I'm going to go with one is seven. And then we've got one, twos, threes, fours, um, fives. Um, I'm not, I'm um, not sixes, sevens, eights, and nines. Okay, but I don't see any sixes on the page that is the original page. Uh, it could, but it also could be a five. It could be a six, it could be a five. Which, one's one's notebook? Which one stand out? Uh, it could be a six, it could be a five. But it can also be a three. Um, three, four, five, six. It could be a seven. Um, okay, it could be a six, five, three, or seven. Or, aha, okay, so here, number four, it could be, I don't see any ones. There's twos. There's threes, um, there's fours, there's fives, there's sixes, there's sevens, there's eights, and there's nines. So I guess this is a one. All right. So does that mean it's one and one? All right, we're, get, we're, we're gonna see if I understood this correctly. <sighs> Come on, come on, thank you. Wait, no, just come, cry out loud, door. All right, let's see if I understood this assignment correctly. Um, where's, can I, there, there we are. Okay, so we got seven, uh, five, and one. Okay, and let's try three. No, how about, uh, five, six, how about seven? Okay, do I, okay, none of that was correct. All right, um, is it one, one? No. Some of them will make up a cipher. Let's see. Okay, let's go back then. So, this has got, there are no ones here, but there is, wait, I'm trying to, but there is a one there. There's twos on both sides. There's threes. 
there's fours, there's fives, there's sixes, there's sevens, there's eights, there's nines. And there's zeros on both. Um, um, wait a minute. No, that can't be a one. Because there's a one here. There's one twos. Yeah, okay, wait, yeah, I am screwing this up. There's one, twos. The fourth one might be, hold on a second. The fourth one might be three, four, it could be a five. It could be a six um, or a seven, but n not an eight or a nine. Okay, I think I was looking at this backwards, so. Um, this one is three. Three, wait, yeah. Three can be either... I think it's starting to rain outside. Or somebody is violently urinating on my wall, on my window. Two, three, four, five. Um, um, wait, hold on a second. I don't see any sixes. Is there a six? I don't see any sixes here, so it could be... Wait, is there? One, five, five, zero, five, zero, five... No, 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 it isn't six. It isn't a six. It's not seven, eight, or nine. Okay, so three is one, and four could be three, five, six, seven. Okay. All right, all right, hold on a second. So, seven, five, one, and either three or five six seven hey it was six okay well we got another cipher thing the judge tried to strangle me and he would have succeeded if it wasn't for oh it's another flashback okay the judge tried to strangle me, and he would have succeeded if it wasn't for the man in the top hat and mask. He killed Judge Norton right in front of me. He cut his throat. Looks like he was trying to save me. But why? Because he's probably your dad. I'm starting to suspect he might be your dad. Possibly. I don't know. Christ, I can't do it on my own. There's so much blood. Dear God, is this one of the guests? I don't know. Go get someone. He'll bleed to death. Press on the wound. I'll get help. The janitor is upstairs. Room 207. Where are you? Who is this? Easy. Don't try to get up. No one will ever talk me into a mountain trip again. There he is. Looks like that missing fellow. The detective showed guests his dagger type. Detective? You mean that nosy fop Walter Gilman? Holy mother of Whoa. God! I have to telegraph the sheriff. This man needs a doctor. Uh, I've seen wounds like this. It's only a matter of minutes. I'm sorry, son. These voices... There are so many of them. Wait, wait. I, I think I've heard this conversation before. They said that a certain detective, Walter Gilman, looked for the judge. He was interested in missing people. Maybe at the reception desk I can find out his room number. Okay. Um, I can hear so many voices. First, I thought I was delusional again, but no, this is different. It's as if for some reason I've started to hear the past, to notice its traces. Maybe I was going insane, but it seems so real. It's as if I've started... It's as if I've started clearly seeing the memories that were hazy before. I can hear the witness of John Norton's death. The man with the slashed throat was the missing judge, but also my father's friend and associate. There was a detective at the end at that time who apparently looked for Norton. I must find out how much he managed to discover. I'll try to find out his room number by checking out the guest registry. He might have left something there. Okay. Locked, of course it is. And also locked. And... Um... 
Judge John Norton, father's former associate. Is that possible? I've just witnessed a crime from a decade ago? I'm getting lost. Memories and delusions all bleeding into one. Okay. A missing judge. Someone has been looking for him. Walt was the janitor who usually kept the reception keys. Oh, nice. Room 207. Sure, it's nothing to worry about. Lots of candles. Oh no, the gas main is loose. Can I can I not like this? I wanna like that. Um is that one that I can there we are. Nope. There. What's that? I'm trying to. Can I just. I wish I could just pick them up automatically, like the bullets from earlier. That'd be convenient. Can I like that? No. Darn it. Um. 106. So, wait, yeah, this is where the janitor was in 106, right? So he should be right in here? I mean, are you saying I need a key? Or that I have the key? Nip. 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 Wait, can I? Can I? Oh, there we are. Um. Oh, darn it. What's this? What the? Pyrite lump. A lump of pyrite from my father's mind. Some call it fool's gold, but it has brought considerable wealth to the hide in Whitehead families. What is it? What's pyrite? Is it, is it worth something? Eh, not to me. Um. Once again, there's the gas, there's, it's just a gas main, just a gas leak. Nothing, nothing to get worried about, just a gas leak. Um, am I just a gas leak? Just nothing else but a gas leak. Okay, so all of that's locked. Um, do I need the keys somewhere? Do I find the keys somewhere? Somewhere else, I'm guessing? Probably where this thing was from, thrown from. Oh boy, this is gonna suck. Okay, locked. Uh, barricaded. Locked. But but barricaded. You're a ghost. You're a ghost. I know you're a ghost. No, you are. That was a ghost. And now I'm at. 113, okay. Can I... Thank you. Um... Book. Locked, locked, locked. Matches, thank you. Um... Nothing. Kerosene, thank you. And nothing. You think you're funny, game? You think you're funny? 
not funny. It's not funny. Oh, you just think you're just about just. Yeah. All right. Whatever. Whatever. Uh, was was it left here by one of the guests? Uh, for nothing is secret that shall not be made manifest, neither anything hid that shall not be known and come abroad. Okay. And there's 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 nothing here. Okay. Um, what's this? Meshes? Is there? I mean, is there something here? I don't like the Michael Myers whispering. Um, is this something I can lift up? I mean, it's it's a big old hatch. You'd think I could lift it up. Hmm. Well, I'm not gonna throw that. I think it might be a Bible. There, gracefully on the on the on the on the chair. Um, locked. Locked. Hi. This is the haunted mansion. What is that? Oh, Karis. No, I want. I want that one. Thank you. Mm, lighten that. I mean, should I be concerned with the fact that there's a bunch of stuff that's already lit? Uh, I don't like everything with the white sheets on it. I saw the others. I know how this works. Oh my goodness, and I'm walking underneath a ladder. Well, that's just... No, I'm just asking for it. Sorry, actually, that no, ladder doesn't go anywhere. What's even the purpose of the ladder? Other than... I mean, is it like a hidden feature in the game that if a player goes underneath the ladder, they get seven years bad luck? Or they, they, they something bad happens to them because they went underneath the ladder? Admittedly, that would be kind of... Oh, I got an achievement. Loth, moth, light 30 candles. Stream Elements is broken. What are you talking about? Stream Elements is broken, Danish. Aha! Uh -huh, that's what it is. I, um, I adjusted something uh, in stream elements, Danish. Because somebody was spamming it the other day, so I put a cooldown on it. I may have messed it up. Who is this? What is he doing here? Um... Okay... So I'm now, now next to room 207. Locked. And what's that? Like a hacksaw? Oh yeah, that's like a doctor's office. Or a butcher's office. I don't know, but that's that that's a ha that's a hacksaw in there. What can I no? Oh. Um, is there anything else? Oh no, Yoko Ono is here! Um, what, 
wait, I still want to see. Okay. Crazy, that was actually very nice timing on 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 your redemption and the sticker because the guy crawl was crawling over the over over the, over the window and the whole thing he landed out a big blah, 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 sound and then there was also creepy music in the game but at the same time there was a blah, 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 that's that came from your redemption. It wasn't it wasn't terrifying at all. It wasn't terrifying at all. Mm, okay. Continuing with this. Oh, golly. Okay. What do we got here? Dear Mr. Hyde, my wife and I had hoped that the week we were to spend at your establishment would be as pleasant and soothing as an experience as it was advertised in the brochures. Indeed, the forest provides a calming ambience, and long walks in crisp mountain air are surely beneficial for the health. Unfortunately, this is all the praise I can offer, and I'm only writing it out of a courtesy. Every single night, some deranged brat with a haunts the hallways of the inn, running wildly, laughing hysterically, and repeatedly knocking on our door. I tried to scold him multiple times, but he would always manage to run from me or hide somewhere. It was evident that he knew every nook and cranny of the place. The realization came only on the day of our departure when I saw him entering your office. That little bugger wasn't the child of, our, of your guest. It left unsupervised to pester the other visitors. He was your son. If you can't keep your own child in check and you allow him to run your Ruin your guest long away vacations, you're surely not fit to run an inn. Rest assured that I will relate this outrageous story to all my acquaintances, and I'm quite as a well known figure in Providence, and that my wife and I will give your inn a wide berth in the future. Well, it sounds like I'm a little jerk as a child. Um. Matches and um, is this something I open? Yes, and it does absolutely nothing. Okay. Do I? Is there? Is there something else around here? Like, oh, oh, there are drawers. I'm still looking for. Um, nothing that, no, nothing of significance. What about that? Can I open that? It has nothing. D dang it, I don't want, no, I want to close the drawer. Closing it. Thank you. And what about this one? Oh, also nothing. Uh, what about down here? Ooh, okay, kerosene. Why is, why is this, why is this thing lit up so nicely? Again, how is this thing lit up so well? Are there like... Darn it, I'm so paranoid. I could have sworn there was that chair was a person. I could have sworn that chair was a person. Um... Where... So I have to get in there, and it's a way over here, and I can't. What the? Oh, okay. Damn, there's a chain. <laughs> oh my goodness, a face. So sharp. Maybe I could use it to cut through the chain. Well, yeah. Search room two o. Thank you, Lord. Um, and there's been plenty of jump scares already in this game, Crossy, which has gotten me quite well. That one did absolutely nothing for me, though. Oh, I can, it's right. Yeah.
Um, I think it's because I'm starting to become a breath, a breast of this game's. Um. Oh, darn it! Can I help you, ma'am? What was that? Where did it try to drag me? To hell, maybe? No, no, no. This doesn't look what? like San Francisco. Oh my goodness, my tummy is rumbling. Um, anything? No. Anything? Locked, 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 locked. No. Um, no. Um, oh, oh, more kerosene. Okay. How much kerosene do I have? Oh, 34. Hot dog. Um, more matches. Neato. Can I unlock it? No, I can't. And suitcase. Can I, wait, can I? Well, I want to open this suitcase. Oh, fine, forget it. And what am I supposed to? Um. Well, what's the po wait? Do I climb? Oh, I use it to climb up. Oh, I see. I was like, why am I knocking that over? I don't understand. Um. Okay. Is there gonna? Oh, there's the hacksaw. Looks like a slaughter. Good God! Something's wrong here. Now everything looks fine. This just seems like a regular Friday night to me. They should cut through the chain in the janitor's room. Yeah, we got OPEC, the first magazine edited by patients. What? The first, uh, a magazine created for the patients of a psychiatric hospital. In many such places, patients cannot even dream about such amenities. They get fed, pigs swell, and try to and, and tied to their beds. Many don't survive their stay, and the ones that do are never really free men again. It should be considered great luck to even get out of such a situation. And we need to bring them back. Just saying. Um, like that, and can I, oh, oh, do I, <laughs> this again, weird mechanic, weird mechanic, I actually, I have to move my mouse to do that, ooh, I'll be taking those, and is that a thing, no. But can I, can I just, thank you. Alright, and... Okay, Mr. Facey, could you just... Hey, I might still want that. Can I have that for later? Mm. Wow, Janitor had a big place. Do all janitors get such big accommodations? <laughs> Can't see. Um. Once again, the whispers. What's with the whispers? Not a fan of so, the whispers. He spent most of his life here and after death. He's still the inn's janitor. But now for eternity. Well, maybe that's maybe that's what he wanted. From what I can see are sure to cause trouble. Um paper. 
Uh, Mr. Jacobs, keep telling me to lay off the ball. He says that I'm seeing things, but I swear that it's all real. I drink because I'm afraid. Something lurks in these forests. I've heard some inhuman screams in the trees and howling in the caves. I've seen claw marks on the bark. Mr. Jacobs says, calm down, you drunkard. You'll scare away the guests. What if they should be afraid? How many people have gone to the forest and never come back? My god, I can hear this howling again. I won't find any rest tonight if I don't take a swig or two. Uh, okay. You think of it, just no. And collect ten notes as Nicholas. But can I, what, do I? I'm just gonna take this and be on my way. Um, did you do that? Um, I'm sure it's fine. I'm sure everything's fine. Oh, boy.